sponsored by Jim Bass Cars and Trucks. And welcome back, everybody. Taking a quick look at our six-hour time lapse, we had plenty of those low-level clouds, and then we had some sunshine coming in. We've been having a mix of sun and clouds throughout the day. Partly cloudy skies continue to stick around with us as we head into our afternoon hours. Now, right now, we are sitting with 79 degrees in San Angelo. Winds coming in still from the south, 22 miles an hour. It's a bit of a breezy afternoon for today. Temperatures around the region are sitting. We are looking at mid to upper 70s, starting to slightly get into those 80s as we head into, like I said, the afternoon hours. And those winds have been pretty steady throughout the day. We're looking at 15 to 25 miles per hour around the region. Gusts up to 35 can be expected as we go through later today. Humidity levels have gone down a little bit. We're still seeing a lot of 40s, 50s, even 60s, but it's going to feel a bit muggy out today. So slightly on the humid side for our afternoon. Now, temperatures are mostly 70s. We got a lot of 80s around Texas, too. And that extends all the way up into the Great Lakes and kind of encompasses a lot of the eastern part of the U.S. We still got a lot of 30s, 40s, and 50s in the Rocky Mountains area. And as we continue through our afternoon, not, again, not too much going on. We do have some showers moving through the Dakotas, and that will be heading into Minnesota a bit. We do have more showers, a line of showers actually kind of moving up into Iowa and will eventually head into Wisconsin but for our region and the Concho Valley not too much just a few clouds drifting through the sky pretty lazily as we get through our Tuesday breaking down our day planner we are expecting like I said a partly cloudy skies throughout the rest of the day those winds are not going to be calming down anytime soon still maintaining from the south about 15 to 20 miles per hour highs are expected to be a little bit warmer than than what we had last couple of days where it's going to be what I call like a taste of uh, summer is coming up. We're looking at upper 80s to low 90s around the region for today. Now tonight, we're going to be dropping just to 60 degrees. We're going to have a decrease in cloud cover. Wind's still pretty steady from the south up to 20 miles an hour, and then a cold front's coming through. Wind will shift coming in from the north 5 to 15 miles per hour. That cold front isn't going to be too significant though we're only looking at low to mid 80s so we're only going to be dropping about five to ten degrees from this particular system so the clouds will be clearing out tonight we're actually going to see plenty of sunshine tomorrow and heading into thursday as well so it's going to be a little bit more for us here and we actually are going to have that dry line move through our area as we get into the afternoon hours heading into tomorrow looking at the rest of our seven day forecast here we will have partly cloudy skies on friday with 90s once again 93 for sunday but a cold front coming through later sunday will give us a 20 to 25 degree drop for the region you're watching klst news at noon we'll be right back after this